Okay, so I just got back from Aldi. I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I got. And then I'm gonna be sharing with you my meal plan afterwards. So starting over here, we got two things of the probiotic yogurt. My kids love these. I got the strawberry ones this time. Um, my kids requested these um, drinkable smoothies. My daughter got these last time we were there and she loved them and she wanted them again. And luckily they had them, so I grabbed her a pack. Uh, my husband requested two things of cookie dough, um, so I grabbed those. Um, as I was walking around shopping, I got a text message saying two um, chocolate chip cookie dough. So I grabbed those. Um, I got two things of cottage cheese. I got a thing of sour cream, 2% milk. I got some white vinegar. I got a bag of onions. Um, normally, I like to get just like one or two onions at a time but Aldi only sells the bags of onions, so I just grabbed a bag of those. Ham, I got two things of eggs. We didn't really need eggs, but I'm also gonna be making the breakfast sandwiches that I make. Um, you guys have seen me make those a ton on my channel, and there's a short on my channel now as well. Um, but I just got two more things of eggs for that recipe. Um, I got two things of tomato, basil, and garlic sauce. I wanted to get the Rayo's brand because they had those at Aldi. And I grabbed one, but then I saw it was $6 for one jar. And I was like, nope, that's not in the budget. So I just grabbed a couple of these ones. And then I also got um, some Parmesan and Romano cheese for whenever we have spaghetti. Um, I got two things of imitation crab for a recipe. Um, I got, I splurged and got some paper plates. Um, I quit buying paper plates whenever we had to tighten up our budget. But this time I grabbed some because I'm tired of doing dishes. Um, I got some crispy fried onions for a recipe. I got three things of sweet corn. Um, we used, we like to have corn and mashed potatoes as a side and it's just good to have on hand. So I got some of those. I got a thing of cream of chicken. This was like 60 cents. So I grabbed this one. It's for a recipe. I got a tenderloin. We had this last week and we really liked it. It's the mesquite barbecue one. Um, so I grabbed another one of those. I'm gonna put it in the freezer um, for whenever we have it this week. My camera does not want to focus this time. Um, I got three things of chicken. I got three packages. They were all a dollar off. So I stocked up. Um, we need chicken for two of the recipes this week. And then I got an extra one as well since it was on sale. I got three things of cream cheese. Two are for a recipe and one is for bagels. My youngest loves bagels. I got two things of string cheese. My husband likes to take these for lunch. Um, I'm sorry if my camera keeps going in and out of focus. I'm not really sure why it's doing that, but just bear with me. Um, I got some of these maple um, sausages. My husband loves the maple ones, and I put these on the breakfast sandwiches that I make. Um, he prefers maple ones, and they had them, so I grabbed those ones. <clears throat> some Kraft cheese for sandwiches and the breakfast sandwiches as well. I got some green onions down here. I got two things of stir fry. I meant to grab two teriyaki stir fry, but these will both work for the recipe. And I got one teriyaki one and then one vegetable stir fry. I got some frozen green beans. Got a thing of gala apples. My kids love apples. They love fruit in general. So got a bunch of fruit as well. And um, we also had oranges and bananas and blueberries on hand. So I just got some to fill in. Um, I got some cotton candy grapes. My kids love cotton candy grapes and they had them, so I grabbed some. But there's really not that many, so this will probably last like one sitting for my kids. Um, and then I got some strawberries down here, some grapes over here. I got a thing of blueberry bagels. I almost said waffles, but they're bagels. Um, I got a thing of tortillas up on the ice machine. Um, I got some bread and then three things of English muffins. And then to finish up the grocery haul over here, I got some tortilla strips, I have like salsa and cheese in the fridge to dip. Um, I got some barbecue chips. My oldest prefers barbecue and my youngest prefers regular. So I got a bag of each. These garlic knots are delicious. Every time I go into Aldi, I grab one and put it in the freezer. Um, and then whenever we have spaghetti night, I put these in the oven and they're delicious and we really like them. So I grabbed some of those. We didn't need them, but I grabbed some. I got two things of the Parmesan garlic and herb pita chips. My husband likes to eat these with the cottage cheese. Um, I got some saltines as well. They're just good to have on hand. And then back here, I got some of these um, Black Forest Juicy Burst um, gummies. Got those for my kiddos. And then I got this stovetop turkey 
stuffing. And then two things of penne. I needed to stock up my pantry with um, spaghetti because we've been eating spaghetti quite a bit in different recipes and I realized we were running low. They only had two pound thing of spaghetti so I'll just cut this in half whenever I go to use it. Um, and then I got two things of the um, confetti cake mini muffins. Um, last time we were there we got a box of the chocolate chip and then the confetti ones and my kids really prefer these ones so I got two of those. I got these. Don't tell my kids. They're for myself. And then um, I got two things of the shredded wheat. My husband likes to have these with coffee. And then tonight for dinner, I am choosing convenience over cooking. So I got a um, take and bake cheesy breadsticks. I didn't even realize they had these there. So we're going to try those. And then I just got a pepperoni pizza. Just got back from Walmart. I'm going to go ahead and show you what we got. We got some Q-tips, got some 2% milk. I needed some face wash so badly. So I got this Hydro Boost. Face wash, the kind that I always get. Got some scotch tape for wrapping presents. Got some microban, I was completely out. Back here we got some peanut butter and jelly. Um, my husband likes to take peanut butter and jelly sandwiches to work with him, so we had to get more of that. Got 40 Ziploc freezer bags. We needed some sugar. I got a few gift cards. Um, we got this white bread and two things of this really cute wrapping paper. My groceries are put away and all of my cold stuff is in the refrigerator and in the freezer I'm gonna go ahead and share with you what I'm gonna make for dinner this week um, I'm going to make steaks corn and mashed potatoes um, we have frozen steaks in the freezer that I food saved and then uh, we have some pre-made homemade mashed potatoes that I also froze <clears throat> so we have all that stuff on hand um, and then I'm gonna make chicken stuffing and green bean I guess it's a casserole um, I saw the recipe on Instagram so we're gonna try it. I'm gonna make the mesquite barbecue tenderloin with some sides, um, probably mashed potatoes and corn as well. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna make frozen pizza tonight for dinner. Um, and then we're gonna do stir fry teriyaki chicken and I'm gonna home make some crab ragoons, I think that's how you say it. Um, I have to get the wonton papers from Kroger and then the duck sauce from Kroger as well. Aldi didn't have it, I thought they had them, but they don't. So I'm gonna do a Kroger pickup <clears throat> for this tomorrow. And then I'm going to do spaghetti and tacos. We always have stuff on hand for spaghetti and tacos. So I usually save those two things for the end of my um, groceries. So that pretty much does it for this video. I spent $200 at Aldi. Um, I felt like that was pretty good for all the stuff that I got. Because I needed dinner stuff and um, snack stuff as well. So thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you in my next one. Mm -hmm.